With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let's start this question. This question says that an integer is chosen at random between 1 and 100. We need to find the probability that it is case 1 is divisible by 8 and case 2 is not divisible by 8. So for that let's first find the total number of outcomes of this experiment that is total number of outcomes equals so an integer is selected between 1 and 100 so there are like 98 outcomes because 1 and 100 is to be excluded because the integer is chosen at random between these, these two so total number of outcomes is 98 now let e be the event that the number is a multiple of 8 so now number of integers which are less than 100 and multiple of 8 so we need to find out that and for that 12 into 8 turns out to be 96 and that is less than 100 and if we just add 8 to 96 we would get 104 so 12 into 9 is 104 that is greater than, greater than 100 so there are 12 multiples of 8 less than 100 so the required probability therefore probability of event e equals 12 by 98 that is nothing but 6 by 49 now let's look at the other case so in this case let so this is case number two and that was case number one let e bar be the complement of event E then E bar is the event that the number is not a multiple of 8 which we needed to find then we know probability of n event e plus probability of its complement that's always equal to 1 that's an identity we can remember that and just using this we can find the probability of e bar in our case in this case it turns out to be 1 minus probability of e that is 1 minus 6 by 49 which is finally equal to 43 by 49 so here is the probability of the second event and that's the final conclusion thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today